Hi, I'm ESA astronaut Matthias Mauder. I will be mission specialist on the NASA SpaceX Crew 3 mission to the International Space Station. I was born in Germany. I grew up there and for the first 20 years I actually stayed in the more or less the same area. I was an ambulance driver for almost two years and I also financed my studies later on by working on the weekend. I studied two years in Germany, material science, then I went for a year to the UK, studied their material science and discovered how much you can learn while being in a different country. That was a huge inspiration for me and I decided to keep on learning more languages and continue in different countries. In 2008, ESA started the call to, for new astronauts. Out of 8,500 applicants, only 10 candidates passed all the tests and were considered suitable for astronauts. I was one of them. I was always fascinated by space and what does an astronaut actually do? So an astronaut works with a lot of engineering stuff, we do science in space, we work in international teams and the adventure that we are able to live as astronauts and a combination of these four facts, engineering on the edge of what is possible, science, international teams and adventure that's only possible as an astronaut. I think Crew 3 is a kind of a rookie crew with only one experienced space flyer. Tom. But on the other hand, I don't feel like that we are rookies at all. Raja has a huge background in flying. Kayla, she has a huge background in working in a very difficult and highly technical environment. I don't consider both of them rookies. I believe we are an extremely good team and after a few days in space, I think we will be there and it will be our environment. Once we arrive on the International Space Station, we will run a lot of experiments. I'm a a material science engineer and so my focus will be lots of experiments in the material science domain. The name of my mission is Cosmic Kiss. It's a declaration of love to space and especially to the two only oases that we have in space, our beautiful planet Earth and the International Space Station. The patch is inspired by Skydis of Nebra. It's a 4,000 year old disc that was found in Germany and it shows to me that people already 4,000 years ago watched the night sky and were fascinated with the universe. And they probably asked the same questions that we ask ourselves. How did the universe start? How did life come to our planet Earth? Is there life somewhere else in the universe? There's a huge number of people in Europe, in the US, in Russia, in Canada, in Japan, all those people that contribute that human spaceflight is actually possible. I want to say thank you to everyone who helped me to uh, arrive at that point that I'm today. I will be thinking of you when I fly to space and um, I send all my love to you down on the ground. <laughs>